we are back again for another <laughs> warrior quest. And we're going to be doing the level 52 quest with Broken Mountain here at 3021 at Camp Bronze Lake. Alright, so let's start this up. Alright, Duty and the Beast. So we're going to get Deliverance. Damage dealt 5%. Using certain actions under the effects of Deliverance will grant Abandon. Each unit of Abandon increases critical hit rate by 2%. When 5 units are stacked, they will become uncontrollable. Cool. So this is going to be like um, Defiance, I think. You know, like we're going to get skills that stack for probably like DPS bonuses. Pretty cool. So. So accept the quest, and then I'm gonna go to the Weeping Saint, which is uh oh, Dravania, Weeping Saint. Where are you? I really don't know what this is. Oh, Corthus, Central Corthus. There it is. Goodness, don't remember where anything is today. But uh. Yeah, um, I do have more free time, so I will be posting a video. I'm gonna try to do a video almost every day now. Um, I've been working deep, like the details out, um, getting my computer ready for streaming and all that good stuff. So expect tons more videos up. Um, I'll try my best to keep them entertaining and full of as much information as I can give you guys. Um, I'm always trying to improve these videos. Um, any support would be pretty awesome. Hope you enjoy these. But uh, yeah, so far, um, because I did have out all of my crafters and gathers, and I have most of my disciples of war magic to 50, I decided to just get them all to 60, one at a time. Um, unfortunately, I don't. I won't have the black mage quest line up for a while but because I did that when Heaven's War came out so it's gonna be a little while on that one but I will do the rest of them and then I haven't done most of the um, the crafting ones either so um, I'll probably have some of those quest videos up soon so keep an eye out all right here here's Broken Mountain all right level 54 cool let's try this um, I did this with black, uh, the black mage one, and it was actually pretty hard, so hopefully I don't die in this one. Thank the twelve you made it. The beast caught us unawares. My brother leapt to my defense and slew it, but in that moment, he was overcome by his inner beast as before in Wineport. Oh goodness. I knew it was folly to bring him here. I beg of you, stop him before he hurts himself. Yes, we'll bring you down. In your fury. I'm assuming we're gonna get these done. Let's do that. because I don't think I need it. There's one more for uh, any aggro here. Um, I don't think at least. Let's do bloodbath. Oh god. Oh, nice dodge. I'll get rid of these things just because I guess they stack up when he does something. It looks like at least. Is the main that bonus, so much back again. Put out of that one. Guess we'll do fracture since we're running around a lot. But uh, it's way easier than the black mage one, I'll tell you that. Let's do 
this again. Maybe because I have like a lot more HP than I did. Oh, this is in the rage. That one needs to die. I think that one heals them. Uh, we'll do foresight again. And then this combo. Get rid of inner rage. I'm gonna do bloodbath again. Let's do awareness. I think I'm gonna pop Thrill of Battle here in a second. I'm losing a ton of HP. I think I am getting like small heals from uh, the mountain over there. Uh, let's do Mame. Let's do Internal Release again. Uh, I think I do Vengeance. Defiance. Oh goodness. Heal me, Broke Mountain. Heal me. <laughs> oh my god. I spoke too soon. Oh, I'm done. Dang it. Alright. I guess I did, um. Didn't think that one through. Dang. I was so close. I guess he got stronger. Alright, we'll try this again. This time I'll have Defiance up. Probably like I should have. <laughs> um, we'll skip the cutscene. That way, I don't have to read that again. Um, but yeah, these uh, these new quests are pretty challenging the first time. All right, those again, 11 k HP. Get rid of those. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Oh, those are, those are killing me. Okay. Maybe I'm not supposed to get rid of those. Do a turn release. Oh, alright. Maybe I'm doing this completely wrong. This is my first time doing this, so... This quest is my second time. Whatever. You get it. <laughs> Storm's Path. This time I'll try to keep my cooldown for after he's on over under 50 HP. That was uh that was intense, that was really picked up. Look at this inner fury cure me, so I'm gonna I'm gonna hit that one. Heal me. Yeah they do. So when I hit them they heal me. So what I think the other one is the opposite, so they probably do as much HP damage as these inner fury sprites give. Inner, inner release. This will take longer, but better safe than sorry this time. Heal. Give him a buff. Okay, so I'm not supposed to do that. That explains a lot. So we're probably supposed to do that one alone. Okay. So yeah, that's why I was dying because I kept hitting him right away, and he kept stacking. So I kept doing like. Tons more damage than he should have. Okay, so this one's coming here. So okay, so he did damage to me this time. Okay, so it's supposed to 
blow up on me. Not me. Go again. Got it. I didn't get any buff on that one. Now release. Don't spam. Well, I mean, I guess I should have uh, paid more attention. Foresight. I'm gonna do awareness. I'm gonna do this storm path. Right? Storm path. I'm gonna do storm path. Get out of here. Oh my god. Thrill of battle. Oh my god, where's that in there? Oh god, that's not good. I can't take another hit. Oh goodness, oh goodness, oh goodness, oh goodness. I need heal. <laughs> <laughs> come on, come on, come on. I'm dying here. <laughs> I need another one of those. Oh my god, that's stack. Oh my god. Oh my god, not again. Oh! Alright. <sighs> what am I doing wrong? Third time's a charm. It has to be. Okay, what am I doing wrong here? So, I know my gear isn't the best, but... Oh, I can do that. Um, I can do that. Forgot, I have tons of these. That's mind. Uh, Vitaly right there. Um, I have tons of gear. Which I should probably... Should have uh, looked through. Nothing for there, nothing there. I have a few one X. Okay. Um oh let's go let's, let's go vitality. If it changes, I can redo it. Okay. I'm missing something. I must have spoken too soon because I was doing so well. Uh Magic, second one source HP. I think I'm I think I'm good there. Storm's eye. Um trades I'm good, job's good. Hmm. Okay. Good time to charm. Alright. Oh good. <laughs> So, Inner Rage heals um, the the blue sprites do buff. It's the, the big buff, so I guess I want to take the hit. We have Echo, again, which is nice because I'm not doing well right now. Even though I'm dodging everything and I'm hitting it. Everywhere. Doing like as much damage as possible. I just don't. I don't think I'm using those inner fury effectively as I should. They should be lasting longer, I think. So I'm gonna hold off on those until I really need them. Foresight. Some of those stacks going. I'll do like a chain. Oh yeah, they're, they're spawning. So I thought, okay. So I thought they were just gonna spawn every time I kill them, but it looks like they're spawning regardless of that. There we go. And they 
they activate when I move through them. So that's probably what happened. So the the inner rages probably spawn no matter what. And the inner furies only have like a certain number of spawns. And I've been using all of them way too early. I think that's what's going on. Let's do that. Let's do bloodbath. Let's do this one. Let's do that one. So that's gonna hit me. I'm gonna go over here. I'm gonna get a heal. There it is. My another heal. There we go. And then I'm gonna get away from there. Vengeance. I'm going to mitigate the damage from with the heals, not from his damage. Does that make sense? So I'm going to eat the inner rage. And then I'm going to go over here. I'm going to get a heal. And then deal with George. That way he doesn't. Oh, he got the. Yeah, that way he doesn't get the buff. So I'm not supposed to hit, hit the rage, I'm supposed to let it blow up on me. Which I didn't do that last time. So I'll, I'll recap after I'm done, because I'm probably going to win this one finally. So I'm going to let it blow up on me. There it is. He didn't get the stack. I'm uh, supposed to get a, a heal. And they do that automatically, it looks like. Oh, I don't have any more, but it's an 8%. Oh, there's two of them. Never mind. I'm good. I'm, I got this one. I got this one. Especially with, like, three echoes. There's no way I can lose. <laughs> there it is. We're both down for the count. Alright. Well, there we go, guys. Um, We'll go through this story, and then we'll recap. Igneal, speak to me. Thank the gods you're awake. When your final blow landed, you and my brother both collapsed. What happened, Igneal? Do you remember anything? Hmm. Your inner beast lashed out as it was trying to escape? I see. The lingering numbness is likely your body recovering from the shock. Otherwise, you appear to be unharmed and in full control of your f faculties. I owe you an apology, Igneal. Once again, I lost control. I have already tended to my brother's wounds. You needed worry. Alas, as, as I su suspected, my brother yet lacks the strength to control his inner beast. As you may have guessed, I called you both here to see if my fears were unfounded. I do not wish to give you co a cause to worry, brother. But when the be beast stirs, my mind grows clouded and my will f falters. Or perhaps I remain silent to avoid facing the bitter truth. Who would trust a protector that could turn on them at any moment? It pains me to do this, but I cannot allow you to accompany Igneal any longer. The risk is far too great to you both. May have it be West we continue this conversation in the safety of Camp Bronze Lake. God damn it. Neil, you've grown so much stronger while I've hardly grown at all. Show Eorzea what it means to be a true warrior. I know you can. That sucks. Alright, I guess we're going back to Camp Bronze Lake. Alright, well that was uh, a lot... A little more frustrating than I like it to be, but we learn stuff, so I can't be too mad about it. That's part. That's why it's a game, you know. If it was easy, then it wouldn't be fun. I really enjoyed that, actually. It was um, frustrating, but in, like a good kind of way. Frustrating, like satisfying to actually get the mechanics type of deal. All right, let's speak to Broke Broken Mountain. So my brother has been in, in a dour mood ever since we returned from the Weeping Saint. Well, that is only natural given his lack of progress, and it may be for the best. The teachings of our people are too dangerous for those who lack control. That is why I chose to focus my studies and how to tame my inner beast. For the sake of my brother, I war not more than to solve this dilemma. 
But the fate intervened, and I stumbled upon the tales of Mithril Heart. But mayhap, we need not forsake one's pursuit for our other. For the other, though, in seeking the techniques of Eld, we may discover the reason why you cannot hold you can hold the beasts in check so easily, while my brother and I fumble about like ch children. However, I am still concerned about what you told me before, about your inner beast lashing out during your duel with my brother. Can you tell me? of that once more. Simply recalling the duel rouses your inner beast from its slumber? Wait, it makes it makes sense. Only the flames of animosity may temper a warrior's soul. I came across these words in a passage and I did not understand their meaning until now. The inner beast stirs when we face an opponent who pushes us to surpass our physical and mental limits. Only in that moment we can attain Mastery of a new technique. This must be how the heroes of Eld, like Mithril Heart, became such legends. They traveled the realm, testing their mettle against the fiercest of foes they could find. Your path is clear, then, Igneel. You must challenge yourself as they did. You must grow stronger and hone your skills to new heights. Alright. We're going to get Deliverance. Ooh, cutscene. Oh, yeah. Acquired de Deliverance. Cool, guys. Um, So, let's recap. So, in this warrior quest, there's a couple things that um, you saw. Okay, so the inner, the, the orange sprites, let's call them, heal you. But they, they heal you just by passing by them. And then we have the blue sprites, which do... If you, if you hit them at all, they will give a buff to Curious George, I think his name. Yeah, they'll, they'll give him a a, um, a big a big um, attack boost if you hit them. So what you want to do is you want to let the blue sprite move over to you and blow up. And once it blows up, you gotta go to the orange sprites and let them heal you. That way. Um, George doesn't get a giant stack of uh, attack bonuses, and that's how I lost twice. I wasn't noticing that that he, he was getting so many buffs from that. So it's yeah. Once you get it, it's pretty easy. As you saw, I mean, I did have Echo because I died twice, but I'm sure you can do it really easily once you know what's going on. <laughs> you know. So yeah. At first, I thought. Broken Mountain was healing me, but then very quickly I found out it wasn't. But yeah, that is the level 52 warrior quest. And um, I will keep working on my warrior, leveling it up to 60 and showing you guys more of these quests. Alright, thanks for watching guys, and I'll see you next time. <laughs>